hey, there's a riff going around that's pretty cool. It's called the Peter Gunn theme. It sounds like this. Oops. <laughs> Okay, so I'm using my pick, holding it on the side of my index finger, which is curled, and the thumb. That's my picking hand. The fretting hand, I'm using index at second fret, middle at third fret, ring at fourth fret, pinky at fifth fret. So that's a really good exercise to get all four fingers working as a team. Um, the right hand is picking really steady like this. You might notice I'm laying the side of my picking hand on the bridge of the guitar. The bridge is where the strings kind of start. So lay it there and work on steady picking. I'm going to play this with a metronome. A metronome will help me keep a steady beat. I'm going to start at 73 beats a minute. So this is a super important tool. Okay, here I go. I'm going to play kind of slow. like. So I'd like you to play along with me. After you practice a little bit, you can pause the video, get your fingers used to index, middle, pinky ring, and you're pressing pretty much on the tips. All right, grab your guitar, make sure you're tuned, and play along. So I ended on an E chord, which we have talked about recently. So that was 73 beats a minute. If you're wanting to play a little faster, I'm going to crank it up to, let's go to 100. 100? That's like 100 miles an hour. So you kind of listen to that. Get the feel for that beat. One, two. Ready, go!
let's get crazy and crank it up to 130. Let's try it. 130 miles an hour. Again, I ended on the E chord. Yeah, I kind of didn't know how to stop <laughs> once I got started. So what I would like you to do is uh, play that at your own speed. Get used to holding the pick. Make sure you're using four fingers. Try to make it as steady as possible. Then come back and play along on the video with me with the metronome. Try to get your speed up a little bit. You're trying to play super steady super steady and consistent so what's the word when you can kind of keep going for a while you want to build that sense of stamina you know if you can if it, it, you know I've been teaching for so many years but you see a student will kind of play then they'll kind of put their hand down and kind of like oh wow can I go home now <laughs> you know like hey there's more than two notes here. You gotta keep going. That's the trick. We and we build that up. You know, the first time you play guitar, it feels really weird on your hands. But the more you dig in and play and repeat, that's what I'm trying to show you is repeat, repeat, repeat. A simple riff goes on and on and on. Keep going. And that's what we want to build up. So if you have to stop and rest, go ahead. But then pick it up and keep building stamina. Okay? Cool. All right, nice work. I'm counting on everybody getting your hands coordinated, and I'll see you soon at a lesson.